Hi guys, so one of my friends just tell me that I can make, um, if I can make a vlog about teaching a child how to read. Because um, this pandemic, we are all affected, especially kids' education. But the good news is, staying home is the best way that we can focus on teaching our child or our children how to read. I was, I want to encourage that I know you can do it. Teaching your child to read can be very rewarding and fun from both of you and your kiddos. How can I help my child learn to read? So that's like most um, questions that um, um, most people or most parents are, are asking. We have so much, um, we have so much um, stuff that we can find in the internet. I sometimes use Pinterest. There's so much um, ideas that you can use how to teach ca kids to read. You can start with the letters. So if your kids like uh, don't know how to read the letters yet, so you're gonna start from reading letters, um, recognizing letters, the sound. Then when he knows or when he or she knows already the, the, the letters, the uppercase, the lowercase letters, that's the time that you can start to blend the words, the blend the letters to the, another letters. Like for example, when they say, you can use the, the letter, like for example, the sounds of B, like B. So how do you make word to the sounds of B, like B? So you're gonna add A, so B, A. Then you're gonna add another letter, which is N. Let's say B, A. Then and you put them together, it's gonna be bun, right? So let's say example with the sounds of C, you're gonna say k, you blend it with a different uh, with the vowel sounds of a, then you put a consonant with t or t, then they put it, they're gonna sound it from first to c, then you're gonna say a, then t, cut, right? So it helps the kids to recognize the sounds of the letters. We start first. The sounds of the letters and then day by day he will recognize the sound of it what's what make the sounds of of water wa, wa, water so it's w right so when you say the sounds of um like a, a cat 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 that's letter c sometimes kids can confuse with the letter c and the with, with the letter k right so we have five different elements of reading. So we have phonemic awareness, phonics, okay? And we have vocabulary instructions, fluency and comprehensions. So there are many games, activities, and books that can help your, um, you achieve your goal of teaching a child how to read. So we have so, we, there are so many um, books, or you can search in the internet what you can use to teach your child to read. You, have, you can make a class card, you put some letters in it, put all the alphabets in there, uppercase, lowercase, write down the um, vowels, vowels like a, e, i, o, o. So those are the vowels sound. So you blended it with a consonant, like for example, B, get the consonant B, and you blend it with a um, short A sound, which is A. Ah. So you put another vowels or consonant on it, which is, say, T, T. So it's going to be bat, right? You put them together, it's going to be bat. So there's so many activities you can make. There's um games that like a bingo. So you, it's like a phonics bingo that you can put them, put the word and the sound of it, recognizing the sound of each letter or each word. So, so first, you start by helping your kiddo understand and manipulate sounds. As they get a little older, it will help them to, it will help them the relationship between the letters and the sound. That's what I said, like the letters with, and the sound of it. So you they need to recognize first the letters and the next one, they will recognize the sound of the letters. This will help them to start the letters to make words. So they're gonna put them together and they're gonna start to blend the letters into words, okay?